Hey guys, welcome to Hollow Acres Homestead. Unfortunately, YouTube would not allow me to go live. I have been locked out of doing live for 24 hours. I don't know what that's about. So I am just going to go ahead and record this video. I have everything set up and ready to go. So I'm going to do my best to get this video out to you by 8 p.m. I have on my computer right now pulled up pickerwinner.co. It's not com, it's dot co. I have put in the information that it has asked for and it is going to generate me five winners. I am going to take my handy dandy little notebook here and write down what it tells me so that I can um, remember and know what to get for you. So here. so here I have my paper ready and before I announce the winners I want to thank you guys so much for participating in this giveaway. It just helps me to get my reach for my videos out a little bit further. I really want to teach people how to grow food especially people who live in suburban areas like I do. Anybody anywhere can grow food and that is my goal. I want people to grow food. I honestly think that the world would be a better place if everybody grew a garden. And that seems like such a little thing, but it makes a difference. All right, let's go ahead and get started on these names. The first winner is Melissa B. Garden. Melissa said, hi, I would like to try seeds for plants. I can turn them into teas. I also love rosemary, lavender, and I'd also like to try to grow more herbs. I'm assuming that says herbs. I love them all. Hard to pick. I agree with you, it is hard to pick. Tea herbs, I wrote that down. Congratulations, Melissa, thank you for playing. The second winner is meagain076, says congrats on 200 videos. We love watching and learning. Well, thank you very much. You did not leave any recommendations for any seeds, so um, I will give you instructions in just a little while and um, follow those and tell me what you want. Otherwise, I'll just um, send you whatever. <laughs> the third winner is Michael Morris. Thank you, Michael. You comment on every single one of my videos. You are awesome. Michael says, purple or green cauliflower seeds. I don't have purple or green cauliflower seeds. I have white cauliflower and I have purple broccoli, so I'll see what I can come up with for you. The fourth winner is Red. Red says, congratulations on your 200th video. Thank you. I'm always interested in other people's favorite seeds. If I won, one of your favorites would be great. That's awesome my favorites. I love red sunflowers. I love herbs. I love all the plants. You made that difficult for me, didn't you, Red? And the fifth winner of this seed giveaway is Melanie White. Melanie says, I just found you. I am 52. I just started gardening last year. I watched and right away learning things I didn't know. That's the goal. I would be honored if I could win some seeds. I would like to try loofah, any kind of flower seeds that would survive in southern Idaho, and any type of tomato. Or I, or I could totally be on board with a variety of seeds that you think would grow well here. Thank you so much for your comment, Melanie. I am so glad that you are here. And yay for starting a garden. Congratulations on that. That's fun. All right, the winners have been announced. Congratulations, everyone, and thank you so much for playing. Now, if you are one of the winners, what I need you to do now is, because there is no messaging on YouTube, I have no way of getting a hold of you. So I'm going to give you two options. You can either email me or find me on Instagram and send me a direct message. Hollow Acres Homestead for Instagram. And to send me an email, it's hollowacreshomestead at gmail.com. Now, what I need in this email is your name, your address or P.O. box and your choice of seeds if you did not give it to me already me again 076 and red if you have since thought of a anything that you would like to try send that over so my goal here on my YouTube channel is yes to share snippets of my life because that is what I'm doing it's my life my journey me documenting the things that we are doing on a daily basis but also, I'm using my YouTube channel to educate people. I honestly think that everybody should be growing their own food. It wasn't even that long ago, but 50 years ago, that everybody was growing and preserving their own food. But now, not a lot of people do that. I will say in the last two years, a lot more people have started picking it up. 
I mean, I only just picked up homesteading the last five years. So and more people are starting to gravitate towards that, and I think that that is awesome. I now have enough knowledge and experience that I can share the things that I'm doing and the things that I have learned. I know how to do something right and how to do it wrong, but it is inevitable that things are going to die. No matter how experienced of a gardener you are, you're going to kill your plants. It's just going to happen. Plant extra. Create lovely spaces that you want to be in. If you're making a garden, put a chair out there. Maybe add some outside decor. Anything that'll get you outside because your garden shouldn't just be a workspace. If your garden is just a workspace, you're not going to be very interested in it for very long. Gardening and homesteading is a commitment. And you have to want to do it. So I highly suggest that you create a space that you want to be in. Now, if you enjoy reading books and you are interested in reading books on gardening, I did write a book. It is called Crash Course into Gardening. It is on Amazon. I am about to pull it down. And the reason for that is because I have decided to revise it. I was not happy with the first version of the book, so I have since redone it and I'm hoping to have it live by April 1st which is in a couple days um, but I think it's going to be like April 10th it's probably going to be the second week of April but that's coming out so stay tuned for that I'm more excited to for this re-release for the revision than I think I was for the first one well thank you so much again for everyone who played for watching this video and I'll see you next time here on Hollow Acres Homestead